Hello and welcome to COVID-19 News Bulletin brought to you by Qatar Media Corporation. The Prime Minister and Minister of Interior, His Excellency Sheikh Khalid bin Khalifa bin Abdulaziz Al Thani, chaired on Wednesday the regular cabinet meeting through video conferencing. During the meeting, the cabinet decided to extend the validity of the decisions issued previously regarding the precautionary and preventive measures put in place to curb the spread of the coronavirus pandemic. The Ministry of Public Health announced 283 new confirmed cases of COVID-19 and the recovery of 33 cases. All new cases have been placed under complete isolation and are receiving necessary medical care. The Minister of Public Health, Her Excellency Dr. Hanan Muhammad al Kuwari, has inspected the Communicable Disease Centre at Hamad Medical Corporation. She was briefed on the treatment services provided by the Centre for COVID-19 patients and reviewed patient care protocols that were specially developed to treat cases of the coronavirus infection and the symptoms associated with it. The National Human Rights Committee has started a series of field visits to a number of penal institutions and places of detention to inspect their commitment to the precautionary measures which have been put in place to prevent the spread of COVID-19. The visits also aim to ensure compliance with the human rights standards set forth in international laws and covenants during periods of crisis. With that, we wrap up today's COVID-19 Bulletin. For more updates, you can follow us on our social media platforms at COVID-19 Qatar and detailed news can be found at our website, covid19qatar.info. Thank you for tuning in and we'll be back with more news updates tomorrow.